Hello everyone. So today we are we will learning how to install the environment of Yolo V6. Uh, so I think in this week, Yolo version have uh, released their new version for the Yolo V6 and Yolo V7. Okay, so it's so excited to try and install the environment in our computer. So today we follow this GitHub, okay, for the original version of Yolo V6. Uh, this is the link. You can try to find it in GitHub and then download the code. This one is download zip, okay. So Yolo V6 is a single stage object detection framework dedicated to industrial application with hardware friendly, efficient design and high performance yeah, compared to the previous version, of course. And then uh, Yolo V6 is composed of the following methods yeah, for the hardware friendly design for backbone and neck, and then efficient decoupled head with the SIU loss. Uh, it will come in soon, another version of Yolo V6 ML and X. And in this one, I think the version is just N, S, and then T for the tiny Yolo. Now, we need to follow this installation uh, one by one, okay? Follow this code, you can clone it, and prepare, of course, your uh, Anaconda, okay? This one, I have the Anaconda, and then this one is my environment for Yolo V6. Okay, the requirements need uh, Python 3.8. After that, you do the PIP install requirements txt, and you do the inference, okay? And you need to download the written models because if we want to training with own data set, it means we need the written. You can click this link. And then this one is the release, okay? Uh, all version is in here. You can download uh, which one you want to implement. And inference is named uh, the same with detect, okay? We'll do the infer like this. And then this is the training uh, with the single GPU and the multi GPU, yeah? It also have the code for evaluation. And then we also can do the training resume, okay? If our training is not finished, we can do the resume, okay? We continue training. Now this one is the benchmark uh, so far for the experiments Yellow Phase 6M, Yellow Phase 6 Tiny, and Yellow Phase 6 S with the different speed and AP. Now, now I will show you, this one is my uh, environment, okay? I already download and we will have this, yeah? Now inside the important part is uh, we prepare our data, yeah? If we follow in here, we installation with our data set. Train custom data, yeah, we follow this one. So before start, we need to uh, install the Python 3.8 environment and prepare our own data set. It will be like this. The format follow the YOLO format that include the class ID, of course, and then the center X, Y, uh, bonding box width and bonding box height. Okay, so I think you guys is uh, familiar with this type of data. The uh, directories, okay, you need to have these directories to separate directories for the image and then labels. For each image, we'll have the train validation and test, okay, and then label is the same train validation and test. These uh, folders is a little bit different with the YOLO V5, okay, in here for the image and label will be in the separate. Uh, folders. And then be careful about your pet and then folders. Okay, if, if you if you are not checking very carefully, they cannot find your image and it will be error. 
Another one is the important part is you need to make your own uh, YAML files that contains of the path of your train validation and test. Okay, please ensure that your custom data sets are put in the same parent with the, your directory, your YOLO V6 directory, of course. And then make sure you not forget to write is COCO force because you know whether it is COCO data sets only COCO data sets should be set to true. Yeah, I already try experiments before and I forget to put this sentence and then uh, the results still use the COCO data set so be careful and then you need to define how many classes the number of classes you want to use and then the names the class names for the config file we follow the um, configuration file of uh, the default okay they already have in the config uh, folder you find the fine tune okay and then you can do the training okay training like this we follow the fine tune dot uh, python and then data dot uh, yaml device zero it means using gpu or not and then evaluation inference and deployment now that i will show you my data set this is my uh, face marks i'm not using the proper data set because it's too big okay uh, in this experiments, I download the face mark data set and then prepare the label. Yeah. So in this folder, have a face mark and then annotation, images, and labels. Let's see the images. We'll have the train and validation because the test is not uh, required. Okay. If you need, you can do it. If not, it's also okay. So this is the training. It's content only image, okay? Because this one is in the image file, and then this one is validation, okay? Only for validation. And then how you separate? You can do like seventy percent and thirty percent. Seventy percent for training, thirty percent for testing is okay. Or eighty twenty, eighty percent for training, twenty percent for testing. It's up to you. Okay, and then this one is the label. It's the same, yeah. This one is the txt file, and for each txt, it will have like this x, y, weight, height. Follow the structure of the YOLO, yeah. I will show you. So the first image will have the the XT like this. This is like the bonding box location. Yeah. Sure. Now, after your uh, data set is ready, we need to make the YAML file. Okay. Inside the data and then face marks. Let me open. This is, you need to set where is your train data where is your validation data data that contains of the image and then uh level txt okay like this for example and then it's coco false it is important yeah number of classes three and then names is bad good and known i just classify three yeah in this case okay so follow this one don't forget to put this Coco force. Now, after everything is ready, we can do the training. Yeah, this one I'm still training. I'm still training another. Okay, I will show you. Now, we can go to this one. And then we do the how to train. Like this. But but put the file first, okay? Where is your this one? We need to go like this. And then
uh, like this, okay? So Python to train and then batch 32, workers five. Workers is depends on your computer size or your GPU, okay? And then config YOLO T fine tune uh, Python and then data set YAML and then device zero, it means GPU. Zero or one is up to you, okay? Because I already training here, I will not train again. I just want to show you, okay? This one is workers. Config, now I will show you where is the config here. And then we use the tiny one. Now, in the YOLO physics tiny fine tune, be careful, you need to set up the pretain weight in the folder weights and then yellow V60, okay? I told you the first, uh, in the first time you need to download the pretain weight. So in our folder, you will have this one, weight, pretain weight. This is for training, okay? And then the result while training will be like this. This is a training process. It depends on your computer, okay? Once again, it depends if you have TPU, you have two TPU, so the uh, training will be faster, yeah? So, so far like this, still training. So while waiting, I will show you how to uh, detect or inference, yeah. Inference will be like this. This is the result. Yes. So in this case, we classify by good, bad, and known. Okay. About the mass classification, face marks classification. The result is pretty good. And then it also can write the result in the TXT file will be like this. Yeah, this one is the class and then X, Y, width and height. This is the uh, accuracy or the confidence. Yeah, this is the image and this is the result, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now, nah, it's the same, yeah? You also can write the output in the uh, text file. Okay. So next time I will show you how to do the detection, yeah, but for now, this is uh, the result already done by me. And then I'm waiting my training result. This one is for the YOLO phase six, tiny version, okay? Before I already uh, experiment with YOLO phase six N. Okay, I will compare the result of YOLO phase six and YOLO phase six S and YOLO phase six uh, tiny version. So if you guys interest to um, doing experiments in this area, you can start to install your environment, com your computer environment, and then implement the YOLO uh, phase six. Okay, and another one is the, it just released yeah, this week for Yolo V7. Yeah. I also still try to uh, clone the environment of Yolo v, V7. So after this finish, V6 finish, I will try to implement Yolo V7. Yeah. I will make another video yeah, to share with you guys about the, my experiments learning Yolo new version. Yeah, new version of YOLO. For YOLO V5, I already have, I already make video. You can find uh, my video in another YouTube. Yeah, in my YouTube channel, you can find how to install using YOLO V5.
I hope this tutorial can help. Okay, if I can, I can do it. So of course you also can do it. You just need to practice. Yeah, you need to practice. And if you find some error, you can comments below. Okay, I will try to help you how to solve your uh, installation error. You just uh, give comments below. I will try to reply. And I will make another uh, video Yeah, when this training is finished. I will try to implement another version of your law physics. I hope this tutorial can help and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.